hello guys welcome to my class today we are going to learn how to design and analyze a t beam we can say t beam or floor beam okay so here is the section of the beam this length is 3000 millimeter this is 50 millimeter this is 400 millimeter and this is 300 millimeter okay this is the flange and this is the wave so now we are going to analyze and design the T beam so first open stat pro go to new project click on space give a file name T beam length unit meter and force unit kilometer then click on next click on add beam then finish okay so first we have to create a node first select here for create a node and switch up the snap node now according to our design we have to the beam rest on the columns so at first we create two columns first first then the tv will rest on those two columns okay now copy the node by node cursor select ctrl c from your keyboard ctrl v from your keyboard paste for the node in the y direction is up 3 meter the length is 3 meter then enter from your keyboard this will this is the shortcut of stack pro ctrl c for copy the node ctrl v for paste the node enter ok now again select the upper node copy the node paste the node and the in the x direction it will be 3 meter the beam will be 3 meter or you can say 4 meter give it 4 meter then enter again copy the node end node of the beam ctrl c from your keyboard ctrl v from your keyboard in the y direction it is the minus y direction in the lower okay 3 meter ok now I have to add the nodes by add beam so select add beam and just join the nodes ok now we have our columns and beams ok now I have to fix the columns for that go to support page click on create create fixed click on add select the support select the nodes and click on assign to selected nodes for that this is selected then assign it yes support has been given now go to the member property go to define columns put rectangle this is going to rectangle columns columns are 500 millimeter by 500 millimeter in the converting meter is 0.5.5 add now for the T beam okay now goes to the drawing and I am going to minimize it for your better understanding go to define go to tv now see the picture the upper is zd this is zd this distance is 3000 meter we give 3 meter it is on the millimeter and the yd is the total distance that is 400 millimeter and 50 millimeter that is 450 millimeter in the meter it will be 0.45 now the yb that is the wave okay now yb is 400 millimeter in the meter is 0.4 zb 
that is 300 millimeter in the meter it will be 0.3 okay now check the values again zd is 3000 millimeter as it 3 meter yd is 450 450 that is 0.45 yb is 400 that is 0.4 and zv is 300 millimeter that is 0.3 then add it close it now maximize it now we have our tv property now select the column property select the columns okay now click on assign to selected beams assign yes now the, for the tv select the member and select the property of the tv click on assign to select beams assign yes now go to the 3d render view for the view now you have your tv okay or you can check the only beam by selecting that and there is your tv okay now i have to keep the load go to load case detail click on add click on date load okay give a title date add it close it click on add add some loads that is first of self void and the member load give a member load it is udl minus 10 kilonewton as you say add the no yeah, udl self void goes in the whole, whole structure so we go to the assign to view assign yes and the udl goes to the beam okay now click on assign to select beams that is assigned is the deselected click on assign yes now you see all the loads are given now you have to analyze it for that go to comments analyze perform analyze select the all option click on ok now go to analyze run analyze see there is no error no warning no notes you done a perfect job okay uh, go to the you can go to the view output file or see the you total applied load what we applied and total reaction load what is the reaction okay in the y direction And go to the post processing or give the value press control or see the values see the deflection see the bending here on z axial force okay. go to the beam in the bending on Z, bending on Y, torsion, okay. shear on Y. You can have the all values, or there is a table of the values. Okay, now I have to design it. For that, go to con design, go to concrete select your code I am going to select IS 456 then select the parameters available parameters and select the parameters we are going to select clear for that you can select it and click that or you can double click on the parameters if I mean FC then ok now define the parameters clear cover is 0 0.025 for 25 millimeter then add it fc for fck 20,000 then add it in by 415,000 add it now these parameters goes to the whole structure for that go to assign to view and assign then yes it is same also if I mean goes to assign to view for the whole structure
structure now the parameters are assigned and now go to comments go to design beam add and design the column add now for beam goes to beam select the beam as I selected beams, assign yes, and for the columns, select the columns pressing control from your keyboard and assign to select the beams and assign then yes. Okay, all that complete. Now go to the analyze it. Perform analyze. Okay, analyze. Sorry, analyze. Perform analyze. No print. Okay, and analyze does not it take comment analyze perform analyze you can go to all ok now analyze go to editor delete the perform analyze it and delete from your keyboard now save it Now we are going to find what is the problem. Go to comment, analyze, perform analyze. Okay. Analyze, run analyze, then save it. You see there is no error, no warning and no notes. So we have done all the perfect things. Then done. Now for see the reinforcement, click double click on the beam and you see the concrete reinforcement. Top reinforcement is 10 millimeter, 4 number, bottom reinforcement is 10 bar, 4 millimeter. Sorry, 10 bar, 4 bar, 10 millimeter. Dial. You can, see, you can see the loading, shear bending, deflection. Okay. Now in the tutorial, the analyze is not taken. Okay. For that, if you want done something wrong, then change it after analyzing it. Then, if you analyze it double or thrice in one at a time then it will show a error for that go to if you want to remove the error go to the state editor just delete the perform analyze or you down if you want to remove loads or property you can delete the property or load see there is a self weight we give the self weight we give the member load all the things are here also okay so you give also the concrete design for reinforcement for columns okay go to the post processing you can have the reaction for columns select it for move the reaction you see the beam the bending moment on the beams okay so that's how you design and analyze a T beam. Okay, so keep practicing it. Okay. So that's it, and thank you for watching my video. And keep subscribing on my channel for more excitement video.